Welcome to the third video of Android tutorial series in which we are working on view animation and in the previous tutorial we work on alpha animation and in this tutorial we will work on translate animation so let's get started first of all I remove this alpha animation from here and here we have to write translate and it requires from x delta I'm passing 0% it means that where the uh, start the animation from where the view is located and write 2x delta um, 80% 50% make it 50% and making 50% and and write duration um, 500 Android repeat mode is equal to I'm making it reverse repeat mode is equal to reverse and Android repeat count is equal to infinite and now Mm, yeah nothing else so uh, here uh, we have made now translate animation so we have already as, uh, created it and assigned it to a button applied it to a button so here we have our button and we here we have our animation so here we type cast it our button and now here we initialized our this animation and now how we started this animation we wrote btn one dot start animation and pass this animation so it will start our animation so let's run this you can see that uh, here we have made a little spelling mis mistake instead of a duration we have brought a dr uh, draw ration or whatever so let's create correct this issue this error so it's duration now let's run so this uh, app is now will be launched and now the apk is being installed so as soon as the apk is installed our app will be launched and you can then see the translate animation so here comes our app and now it is launched and now you can see the translate animation it is moving our button forward and backward forward and backward because the repeat mode is reverse and the repeat count is infinite infinite means that it will continue uh, uh, also um, uh, till we uh, press the back button or close our app and uh, it is going forward and then backward it is because of this reverse so if we make it repeat restart not repeat sorry restart and now run this you can see the difference between uh, re restart and repeat restart and now you can see that the animation is uh, started and when it finishes it again restarts it is not in reverse mode so that's it for this tutorial in the next tutorial we will be working on more animations so stay tuned